Okay, so what we've got here is a kit for land surveying and checking levels. Its nickname on site is Dumpy Level, but the proper name is Automatic Level. Okay, so I'll be testing you on that when you come in college. Right, so next to me here, what we've got is the tripod. Okay, so pick it up, just like so. There's a correct and an incorrect way to carry this. So basically it's got some sharp prongs on the end. I wouldn't fancy that going in the back of my leg. So if we were to carry it that way, there'd be every chance that one of the brakes would be off it, whoop, into the back of your leg. We don't want that. So we will carry it upright, like so. Okay, so what we do to set this up, we take it in our hands. We've got a shiny base there. We don't want to damage that. We put our foot out, it goes on our foot there. And then I'm going to flick the three brakes off. Basically, I'm going to lift this up to my chin, just, be just below my chin, that's where I want it. So I've done one, I'm going to put the brake on. And now I'm going to make the others suit it, so I'm just going to marry them through, keeping it on my foot all the time. Right, now I need this tripod absolutely perfectly level to be able to use it. So what I've got to do, i set it out. I don't want it so it's like this, because that's going to fall over. But I also don't want it so it's daft, like that either. I've got to have it so it's correct, like that. And hopefully, so I'm not going to kick these legs, okay? We don't want any of that. So I look at it, and I've got to take it that it's as level as I can get it. And now how I'll do that, I'm going to eye it through with like the bottom of the window sill, as providing the window's gone in level, I'll take it it has. I'm going to do the same over that direction. I'm going to look, I'm going to eye it through and I'm going to think, oh well, maybe this leg needs moving a little bit, and maybe that one needs moving that way. And then I'll check it again. So, next trick, we're going to get out the automatic level. Open the box and take it out. Then I take my box, for health and safety reasons, I pop it under. Yeah? In this there are some threads. And we're going to marry them threads up with this bolt here. So I hold it over and I turn it in. Okay? Now you might not be able to see there, but I need to get this level so it's equal on an equal platform. So I just move it around with my thumbs. Undo it a bit if you have to. Okay. I've now got to get this part, the telescope, I've got to get it level. Now there's a bubble in here. Now, if you go onto Google or you go into some of the college website and you put in automatic level, it'll bring up all this kit for you. It'll be part of what we're looking at when we research it. So now I've got to get this level. And we use what's called thumbs in, thumbs out method. So I'm just going to turn that. Right, so what we can do with this, if I had an assistant here with me, which I've not, but hopefully you'll be here with me this time next year, or maybe even this September. We've got here what we call a staff. And it starts off at zero, and it goes all the way to the top, and we're looking at about, well, it's coming out five metres. So by the way, it's telescopic. Telescopic means it all comes together and it all comes out together. So when we do this, there's a staff. Now I'd hold this here, like so, and then this person who's on this dumpy level, automatic level, would be able to take a reading off this. You'd be able to take a reading. Now just watch me, I'm going along here, this is a bit lower down here, you take another reading, yeah? So one meat reading minus the second reading will give you the difference in height. So if you were checking brick laying on site or a window level, you'd be able to use this bit of kit to do that. Um, you'll be quite employable on site and I'm sure that anyone who you turn up with, uh, turn up to site and you can set one of these up, I think your boss would be quite impressed with that. Okay.